before we start this video, I would like to firstly apologize because most of the recordings were done on my phone on vertical mode. So halfway through the video, you'll see a change after the unboxings are done. So I hope you enjoy everything and let's get on to it. So I ordered a few things a while ago and it finally arrived. So let's start by sanitizing everything. I opened everything beforehand just to check that everything was there. So let's take the packaging out and see what's inside. My desk is filled and cluttered with everything I bought, but I'm going to show you everything one by one. The first package. It's nothing extraordinary, it's just an extra large mouse pad. I was fully content with the one I had, but it was very dirty and it started to get a bit old. It was like two to three years old, so I decided to change and get a bigger one. A lot of people were commenting on why I had such a small one when I could just buy one for like $8 and that's what I did. I got it off Amazon. It's extremely clean. It's extremely soft. My mouse glides perfectly and I love it. Now for the exciting things. This is a Sweetwater box. As you can see, they sent me some candy. So thank you Sweetwater. That was very sweet of you. This is the Focusrite Scarlet Solo audio interface. It's very compact. It's very potent and it just does what it has to do. It is red, so it doesn't match with my white and black aesthetic, but I might change that in the future. Stay tuned for that. The reason why I got it, as you can see with the XLR cable, is because I upgraded my audio system. As you can see, I got the Blue Compass Microphone Boom Arm. And yes, I know it's a very expensive arm. I know there's cheaper options, but it's just so sleek looking in matte black that I love it. I also got the Rode PSM1 shock mount with the pop filter from Rode. And finally, the best piece of all the upgrades I did, well, maybe not the lights, but this is my new microphone. It's the Rode Procaster Dynamic Microphone. And as you can see, it's a huge upgrade from what I was using previously. Just look at how everything looks. It looks so sleek, it looks so nice. It looks like it should be there. It's just everything I wanted in a microphone and I'm going to do an in-depth review in a future video and why I chose this over other microphones such as the Shure SN7B and the PodMic. Now that the most exciting things are over, let's get on to the more satisfying things. I bought this Anchor Power Surge because I finally manage my cables everything was just so disgusting previously everything was running around everywhere and there was nothing that was managed correctly which is why i didn't show it much in my past video so now i'm just going to show you what i did and i think it's pretty impressive if i say so myself it's completely organized now everything's connected to the power search everything's connected to either a velcro tape or uh, connected to the pc in some way or form as you can see, everything's tidy up on the desk and everything has its correct place. And now for the light show, literally. God, that's so cringy. But yep, these are the GoWe LED strips and they are just perfect to make everything pop out a bit more. They are the best budget LED strip you can find. They are Wi-Fi enabled and they come with an app and they're just so pretty and they light up the desk very well. If you skipped on through, that is perfectly fine. Just enjoy how everything is so clean and has its perfect place on my desk. I'm using my previous microphone as a headphone stand and I am using a head app just to connect several things to my audio system. Anyways, that was my updated 2020 setup. I hope you enjoyed it. Comment down below what your favorite thing about my setup is. And if you didn't like it, comment down below what you didn't like. I know it's been about a month since I've uploaded a video, but life has just been really rough. But now that I'm back, I hope that I can produce more content and more videos that you would all enjoy. So don't forget to leave me a like if you enjoyed it and consider leaving me a sub for more content. Join my discord and leave me suggestions on what you want to see next. So thank you as always and I'll see you next time.